last bit of daylight here on the road and I've got about eight more hours to drive today and I should make it. But I want to share something that just happened very briefly and part of my whole life philosophy that files under my title mage is, what is it? I forgot while I was trying to explain what I'm talking about. I'm not going to edit this one either. I like the excuse of getting away with shit. Sorry, I'm on the road, not editing. <laughs> Can I be on the road forever and never have to edit and save myself hours and hours? No, I love my polished work. Get to the point, spit it out. Vision. Part of my dominant philosophy is that everything that is happening in the physical world exists exclusively as something that we're meant to learn through because the objective in my life, I shouldn't speak for all of us, this is me, this is my philosophy. My objective in my life is be the best version of myself I can possibly be, no excuses, no bullshit, be your best self. You have all this potential, what are you gonna do with it? How could you possibly lay on your deathbed one day and think, gee, I had so much potential, but I never did anything with it because I was watching Netflix and being afraid of what it might feel like to fail or succeed. Or afraid of what people who aren't even in my life might say about what I did. Who fucking cares? Ay, caramba. Be your best self, no excuses. That's the philosophy, but therefore, everything around me is an opportunity or an objectified opportunity for me to learn something through. And all of that was just a little precursor to this. What I'm saying is all is metaphor. All is metaphor. I think that, oh, crampy. I think that is Wittgenstein. But I thought something else was Wittgenstein and I was wrong. I just, I need to brush up on my Wittgenstein. Wittgenstein! As they would say. Still haven't said what I'm trying to say. My glasses. I've been wearing them all day and I have these little pouches of lens wipers. I just cleaned them and I had no idea how disgusting my lenses had gotten until I cleaned them and saw with clear vision. It's just that slowly over the course of the day, they got all smudgy. And because it happens incrementally, it just sneaks right up on you. You know, in the South, they have a, a saying, uh, something about a bullfrog. Mm, I don't know the saying, I wish I could. It's something like, uh, all right. This is what it is. They say you never boil a frog by putting a frog in hot water. He jumped right out. But you put a frog in a pot of cold water and then you turn the heat on and you just slowly, you'll never see it coming. And that's how you boil frogs. This applies to us. This is one such something that serves as a metaphor for us and how we operate. With my glasses, we can take my physical vision as a metaphor and my glasses being dirty and then getting cleaned and my sense of hadn't I'd not even realized that the I was being boiled I didn't realize that my vision and now as a metaphor is it that my inner vision could be cloudy or imprecise in ways I don't even realize because I've just gotten used to it something to think about. Now I've really lost the day and time to drive all through the night.